Hello and welcome back to my channel. No. Hello and welcome to Romany Reacts. This is my channel where I react and review to TV and films. Today we're on Supernatural season eight, episode nine, and it is called Citizen Fang. So we're we talking about a vampire here. Um, if you are new here to my channel, then I highly recommend that you subscribe. That would be great. That'll be great. Uh, that'll be super. Um, and if you did miss the last episode, then go ahead and watch that. That one, we we got a look back at what was going on with Sam and Amelia. It's freezing, cold. It's meant to be coming in summer. It's still freaking cold. We want the sun. I put a cute little outfit on. Not that you can see it. Uh, and then I've had to put a hoodie on because I'm freezing. Anyway, enough of the chatting. Let's get watching. This is Supernatural Season 8, Episode 9, and it's called Citizen Fang. Amelia's husband, who was dead, <laughs> um, actually wasn't dead. So it makes sense why Sammy left. He was obviously just doing it for Amelia. To make her life better. Like, make her choices easier. And Anthony home, so the kitchen's all yours. Yeah, be sure to lock up the door and uh, set the alarm. Turn off okay. the AC. Check the burners, check the griddle. And clear off the cold table. We're I in a Go on now. Uh, cafe. You, okay, so Benny has a job in a cafe? Where have I seen her before? Where have I seen her before? Mm. She's more like a little sister to me, you know? Sure you don't mind if I take a shot? <laughs> She's all yours, Chief. <laughs> that uh, old man think he's got a chance with her? Oh, that would bug me. Someone fucking banging his cup on the thing for his refill. We don't get that over here, like a free refill. <laughs> Not in many places, anyway. So he looked very interested in Benny. Is he another hunter? Or oh, Benny's spidey senses? This kind of looks like uh, an episode of um, True Blood. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> right. Oh yeah, it's um. He's uh, what's his face? He's a hunter. He was in the loony bed. What's he doing now? I didn't. What's he? What was Martin? That. Oh no! It's that old dude. Um. Right, so they're kind of trying to imply that Benny just took a little nibble, nibble, sippy, sippy from that old dude. I don't think Benny you sure? would. Of, okay, great. Just, uh, just hang tight until you hear from <gasps> me, okay? Oh, I, w I wonder if, um... Crazy Martin from the Looney Bend. Glendale Springs discharged him last month. And? I've had him tracking Ben <gasps> for the past week. Go and hunt vampires. Oh! 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 Sammy's... Sammy's wanting to get old Benny. It's not going to be Benny, is it? It's going to be someone else. Obviously. Hopefully. Oh, God, is this when Benny fucking bites the dust, though? No pun intended there. Um, okay. I got into town about a week ago. Up until last night, nothing. He's been clean. Doing what? Just minding his own business, working at the gumbo shack. Benny's working at the gumbo shack? <laughs> I 
followed him right. just like that. Right? <laughs> he turned up a path. I hear a scream. I catch up. Then, boom, there he is. The old coot that Roy was eyeballing at the joint. Vamped. Well, then how can you be sure it was Benny if you didn't actually see him do it? Well, because I saw Benny turn up the path, and then two seconds later, I trip over a body with its throat ripped. Why am I getting the distinct impression that your brother is vouching for a vampire? Guys, let's not argue. Nobody's arguing, but if this is Benny, and that's a big if. Oh, it's him. I got history with the guy, okay? I'm not signing up for a witch hunt. I owe him more than that. Ah, uh, <laughs> he got him out of purgatory. I just need some time, Sammy. Oh, yeah, I'll let the fang take another life? I don't think so. How much time do you need? You're not actually considering this. A couple hours tops. And what if it turns out to be Benny? Then it's Benny and I'll deal with it. I see Sammy's still quite good. He's like, okay. Let, let Dean do his thing. <laughs> I think Martin's still a little bit unhinged. <laughs> okay, we're still doing that. We're still doing the looking back. Okay, so we're back with Sammy and Amelia. Obviously, this is after um, Amelia has found out that her husband that was dead is not actually dead. He's your husband, Amelia. But I, I don't. Well, that would I don't be want so to do awkward, the right thing. I mean, this is the right thing, you and me. And maybe I'm going to hell for saying this, but I'm not ready to give this up. Okay, so then what happens from, to make Sammy? leave he's obviously just doing the right thing isn't he he's obviously gonna go okay she needs to go back to him let me guess gumbo <laughs> was gonna be the gumbo until i saw pie well special pie pie of course it is dean needs Let's pie well roy works a night shift here i mean if we're talking about the same roy benny I got a body here in Cairn Crow with two holes in it. And I just found out you wouldn't fish it. Do I need to tell you what this looks like? Oh gosh. Okay. Let's let's Okay, so there's another body. So is Benny hunting something that's killing people? Come on. <laughs> Hopefully he's not. He's not doing he's not doing the killings. I don't reckon he is. So is is Benny burying the body? Benny, that looks very dodgy, mate. And why is he out during the day? Not me, Dean. Why is Benny out in the daytime? What? Is he allowed out in the daytime? What? Oh my God, Dean turned up with a freaking machete and all. Ready to hack off his head. Rogue Vamp. Came into the cafe a couple nights ago. Youngster goes by the name of Desmond. Okay, so apparently this little rogue vamp that Benny knows from a while ago has been killing people in his path to make him join so they could make a little nest. Oh, cute. I even found someone to hold myself accountable to. That's kind of someone, Dean. Family. Elizabeth. My great granddaughter. You know, as far as she's concerned, I'm just another drifter. I'd like to keep it that way. It's been tough walking the line here. After all those years in purgatory, not having to deal with the hunger. F.A., I'll take my chances. That half wit will sit by my brother, and trust me, my brother is not someone you want to mess with. Oh, okay, so Benny knew that Martin was a hunter. <laughs> uh, 
Let Sam and Dean hunt the vampire for you, Benny. I think Sammy's going to constantly be on your ass, Benny, until he sees you fuck up once. But the one thing I can say about Benny, he has never let me down. In five minutes, Dean. <laughs> well, good on you, Dean. Oh. You must feel great finally finding someone you can trust after all. Dick a knife in it. <laughs> all I'm saying is that Benny. Is Sammy has... gonna. Oh, is Sammy gonna take that? Is he gonna. Okay. What? You're not gonna find him. And if you do, I'm gonna tell you this. You'll be lucky to get out alive. And you, you go with him, you're a dead man. Period. Willing to risk that on Benny's word alone. Damn right I am. <gasps> oh! What was that? Martin just fucking punched Dean. So who are Sa is Sam and Martin going to hunt Benny or Desmond? Oh my gosh. Sam sat in the pub and um, Amelia's husband has just turned up. Well, obviously you would be here to fight, you fucking idiot. Otherwise, you would actually be a fucking idiot. <laughs> I heard about what happened to you. The rough deal. But the only one that knows what's best for Amelia is Amelia. So when all of this is said and done, and she's made her decision, I'll respect it. And if you truly love her, you do the same. Okay. Okay, so that's fair enough. So whoever she chooses, they need to be respectful of that choice. That's fair. My gosh. They freaking handcuffed Dean to the fucking radiator. Dean's going to be so pissed off with you, Sammy. Okay, Dean's Dean's gonna warn Benny. Benny, they're coming for you. And they say they didn't go for it. They're on the way to you. I get scarce. So what now? I go find Desmond. Uh oh, what's that? Sammy's just received a text message from Amelia saying, "I need your help." Sam. Now, come quick. And he's fucking gone. He's running. He, well, he's not running. He's driving. He's off. And he's off. He's going. He's fucking just left Martin in the middle of nowhere. And freaking Martin is going to end up getting killed, isn't he, now? By the vampire. He did not stick around. That was hilarious. Dean's come to meet old Benny. I hope this is not a trap. Going in, they're going into the nest. See, this just doesn't make sense. Some of the choices in this bloody program does, just does not make sense. Dean could have done this. Dean could have gone, Benny, tell, come with us. Show us where it is. Me, Sam, Martin, and you can do this. Oh my God, he's behind you, Dean. He's behind you. Desmond is behind you. Oh my God. Why? Oh. oh, fucking hell. Oh, no. Oh. oh, my goodness. Oh, Christ. Son of <laughs> Off with his head. It took you long enough. <laughs> You lost a step, friend. You lay off junk food. I sliced Dean's neck and ah. nearly bit him. 
<gasps> oh god, Benny. Oh god, Benny, Benny. You okay? Oh. Oh. Benny was having a bit of a moment then, wasn't he? Oh. Oh, I think Dean realised then that Benny well, might be teetering. Over, right, so. I thought Benny meant as in, like, here, as in on Earth. <laughs> Benny, you gotta go deep underground. But nobody knows who you are. Why don't you just go to another country? <laughs> go to Australia. The person you are trying to reach is unavailable. Sammy's fucking panicking. Panicking. What are you doing? I'm, uh... <clears throat> I'm leaving. What? Don found you at the bar. Amelia. He threatened you. Amelia, no, he didn't threaten me. I... Look, I'm just trying to do the right thing here. So she divorced from Don now because they thought he was dead. Will she have to get remarried to him? Not that it matters. <laughs> There's Martin. Hey, Dean. Look, I'm just calling to let you know that the situation is resolved. Benny was not lying. There was another vamp, and we gave them together. Oh, that's good, Dean. Yeah, shut up and listen to me. Benny's long gone, and he won't be coming back ever. So for your own sake, do not follow him. Are we clear? You don't have to worry about me, Dean. I'm long gone, too. Martin's freaking a little unhinged still, isn't he? Hey, Liz. How's your shift going? Mm. <gasps> I'd say she's covering for you just fine, Benny. <sighs> right, so now... Put the phone down, Benny. Give Dean another ring and say... Martin is in the... Diner threatening to hurt... My grand, my great granddaughter, uh, sort that shit out. That's what he has to do. <laughs> okay, Benny has turned around and he's hauling ass back to the diner. Honestly, why did he not just phone Dean and go, Dean, that fucking psycho is uh, at the diner? But no, he's literally gonna end up killing friggin'. Lay down your arms, Martin, isn't you he? Holy thing. And is he going to end up killing Martin? And then you got me here now. He's going to be a wanted man now again. Just let her go and walk away. She's probably so confused, thinking, "You're kind, what ones that live in a camper van?" <laughs> Boy, who's Benny? Who's Benny? See, that's easy. What, like... Find out, shall we? Just go... Oh, look. See that? Oh, God. Dilated pupils. He slit her neck. Hair standing. Signs of hunger. He slit her, her neck. Oh, gosh. Benny's teeth have come out. Ooh. Teeth are horrible, aren't they? Tell her, Benny. Tell her how you're her long-lost grandpappy. Tell her about all the dead you left behind. Tell her about the monster that you are. <laughs> She's like, what the frick is going on? I want your head on a stake. He could literally play it there and go like, what are you going on about, mate? You are mental. Oh, no. Is this going to be it? Is he actually going to fucking kill him? Ah, <laughs> okay. Do you think that's it for Benny? I hope not. Sammy has turned up to Amelia's after his cryptic text message. 
What the hell? She's just sat watching telly with her husband. So who sent him that text message? Was that Dean? Do you reckon Dean... No, Dean... Dean wouldn't be able to send him a text message like that, would he? Or do you reckon it was? Elizabeth? You told me to call you if I saw it. him. Oh my gosh. She's covered in blood. Has Benny, I reckon Benny's killed Martin. Or do you reckon, or do you reckon Benny is dead? Oh God, I don't want to see. Oh, I don't want to look. Dean does not know what he's walking into. Okay, come on, what are we seeing? What are we seeing, Dean? What are we seeing? Pools of blood. Okay. Martin. Where's Benny then? Has Benny done a runner? That is going to be fuel enough for Sammy. I don't understand. Sammy? Sam, I need your help. Come quick. Nice one. Aww. Swapping Amelia's phone out with the burner, sending a distress signal. <laughs> you got me good. Oh, that was cruel, Dean. Cruel. It's Sneaky. Done. Yeah, it's done. Any casualties? Martin? Was it Benny? He had it coming, Sam. Oh, Jesus Christ. Damn it. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> yeah. So, that's it now, isn't it? Sammy's gonna be extra pissed. And he is going to be going after Benny. I knew that was you. Oh. Amelia. In the bar. <laughs> oh, gosh. Poor Sammy. That is the end of that episode. Um, I don't... I don't know how long um, Benny is going to end up being alive for. I think Sammy is going to actually use this as a fucking witch hunt um oh gosh i don't know though at least uh amelia's kind of turned up to uh defuse the situation for five minutes <laughs> um yeah but does that mean so could you not please does that mean that benny drank from martin Oh my god, you just farted! That was the dog! Oh, Summer! Honestly! <laughs> uh, yeah, so does that mean that um, Martin has... She's on her back now. Does that mean... Um... Sorry, does that mean that Benny has drank? Is that going to, like, fuel his vampire within again? Does that mean he's going to start real craving? Craving the good stuff? Yeah. Um, that was really cruel, what Dean did to Sammy with Amelia. But needs must, I guess. Um, yeah. There's not really much else I can say about that episode. I think that Benny's time is slowly ticking by and um, I just hope that Sammy does not catch up with him. Because it's going to be a race. A race against time. So now Benny is going to have other vampires after him. Other hunters after him. Because he obviously killed uh, Martin and Martin's a hunter. Um, and... 
Yeah, it's getting a bit messy, isn't it? What are you doing? What are you doing? Um, let me know what you thought of that episode. I was really confused of why Benny was out in the daylight. I didn't think he could be out in daylight. I didn't think vampires were out during the day. But Benny was. He was definitely out during the day. Uh, and you cannot tell me otherwise. That's all from me for today. Let me know what you thought about that episode. And, ow! And I will see you all for the next one. Bye!